I'm here with Megan Jones, founder of Jones Advisor Group right here in Topeka. And Megan, a lot of us nearing retirement, I think, are kind of going, you know what? I'm retired, my kids are 40, they're doing great. I don't need my life insurance anymore. Do you, I mean, there's a, there's interesting ways to look at this, I think. Yeah, and we run across that a lot. And you might not need life insurance. Maybe you've had it when the kids were young, so you need it to um, you know, get them through school if something happens to you, or pay off the mortgage if, if you were to pass away. So that's the maybe the term type of life insurance. And you're right, you don't need it anymore. But you might want life insurance now, and you might want it for the types of benefits that it can bring to both you while you're living, and then also your family when you're gone. The tax-free benefit is huge, and again, that's one of the ways that we are utilizing these types of investments is to bring the money in, let it grow. If I pass away, it pays tax free to my heirs. And if I need it, I can tap into it. And that's some of those living benefits that you were talking about earlier. Yeah, and I like the idea, obviously, of leaving tax free money behind. Right. So when you think about this, is this just another silver bullet? that we're looking for, <laughs> right? I mean, is, is it, it the, just a tool in our retirement tool belt? You know, I think it really is. I think sometimes people get the misconception that, oh, Megan's just gonna try to sell me life insurance. Well, I'm not selling you anything. I'm providing strategies that provide you a benefit tax-free income for you, tax-free death benefit for your family, maybe some protection against market volatility, maybe, I mean, all these different things that we can use this vehicle and this product for, use it for the benefits that it provides. It just happens to be life insurance. And I think what, Mark, what people maybe don't understand is that it's not the same life insurance that your grandparents had. It's not the same as it was 30 years ago. Just like any investment, um, it's changed, it's evolved. And the landscape that we have to navigate through today in retirement is really mandating that we have some tax efficient strategies. And this is one of them that we can use now. We didn't need to use it before, but in today's dollars, in today's world, we've got to be tax efficient with our money. Absolutely. By 2050, the U.S. Census Bureau says 3.7 million of us will be 100 years of age. We better plan for some of this. So, <laughs> Will if, it be you? No. I don't no. know that it'll be me. No, no it might be you. <laughs> it might be it me. It might be. So if you think about this, all right, I should take all my money out of the Wall Street world and throw it into this IUL, Indexed Universal Life, tax-free, fantastic, right? I should just put everything right there. It sounds like it's the only thing you'll ever need in your tool belt. What I would say is just like anything, asset allocation, diversification is key. So we wouldn't put all our money into one investment. That's not what we recommend at Jones Advisory Group. We think it's important to have investments in a lot of different types of accounts that are doing different things. So maybe we have some money in the stock market for growth potential and liquidity. Maybe we have some money in more of a safe investment, whether it be an annuity or some other form of, of protection so that we have some protection against market downturns. Maybe we also want some tax-free investment income in retirement, and we can use something like an index universal life to do it. And so I don't think there's a one-size-fits-all. I also don't think there's a one investment that covers every single thing that you need your dollar to do. Because we're usually looking for uh, income and growth, but liquidity and safety, and I also want to be tax efficient. And I might not find all five of those things in one investment. So we can use multitude of investments, different types of strategies and different products to get us everything that we need, but by doing it in different accounts, right? Does that make sense? You started Jones Advisor Group in 2008. You've now had 12 years to create yeah. that magic bullet. Why? <laughs> Why? We have, I like the diversification though because that's what it's all about. I think it's key. And it's so important I think for people just to sit down with you and ask their questions. Hey, right. here's my situation. Because we obviously have to be general here, but when you sit down with people, it's about them. We can get very specific and our five-step Money Matters review walks us through income planning. How are we going to get the income when we retire? What kind of investments do we have? And again, that's all those different types that we just went over. What kind of tax Efficient strategies do we have in our plan? What about healthcare and Medicare, maybe long-term care? And then what happens when this money transfers to our family? So that estate plan or that legacy planning is, is very critical to making sure that we send more money to our family and less to Uncle Sam. So we'll go through all of that with you, but again, very specific to our family's needs.